eight Britain's Got Talent acts took to the stage for the fourth semi-final on Thursday as they battled it out for two spaces in the ITV show Grand Final. Dame Nation, the Frontline Singers and the Phantom were just a handful of the acts that performed for Simon Cowell, David Williams, Amanda Holden and Alicia Dixon. Titan the Robot, Five Star Boys, Mary P and Stefano Paolini also performed. Amanda's Golden Buzzer Act Lauren Allred completed the semi-final lineup. However, some ITV viewers weren't impressed with the latest group of semi-finalists. Jongu 16,364,081 tweeted, Britain's Got Woke is getting worse, it's just one sob story after another. Jane Inglefield added, Is there anyone in the semis without a sob story? Alex Ashmore 952 meters remarked, Like many others have said, not much talent anymore just sob story and having a message. Think it needs to finish now. Again a distinct lack of talent. Perhaps just change it to Britain's Got Sob Stories Very few of these people would be on this stage if it was a real talent show, hashtag Mullins 9 meters vented. Meanwhile, BGT was caught up in a fix, Row is Lauren, the voice behind Jenny Lin's iconic ballad Never Enough, performed. Jung Won LLVR tweeted, Don't get me wrong Shush is a great singer, but Shush is a professional auditioning for a talent show. Mazia 1616 agreed. The whole point of this show is to give unknown people a platform who haven't been given a chance before. The audacity of Alicia to say Lawrence had to work harder than other acts because of her fame. That is literally the opposite effect of what positive fame has. After all eight acts had performed, Lauren won the public vote and secured their spot in the grand final. It was then up to the judges to send either the Phantom or Five Star Boys through to Sunday's show.